the deafening roar of the crowd, the anticipation hanging heavy in the air, the heart-stopping tension of a penalty shootout. The FA Cup semi-final match between Manchester United and Coventry City was one for the history books. The match began with United taking control, dominating the first half. The Red Devils seized a three-goal lead, a feat that seemed to promise a clear path to victory. Bruno Fernandes, the star player of the match, was instrumental in this early success, showing his talent with his goal-scoring and assisting record. But as the game progressed, Coventry City refused to back down. They staged a remarkable comeback, displaying a resilience that left spectators on the edge of their seats. The Sky Blues managed to level the scoreline at 3-all, forcing the match into extra time. The drama didn't end there. With a goal from Coventry in the dying moments of extra time disallowed by VR, adding another layer of tension to the unfolding spectacle. The match was pushed into the nerve-wracking trial of a penalty shootout. Andre Onana, United's goalkeeper, emerged as a key player in this decisive moment. His crucial saves proved instrumental in United's victory, demonstrating the importance of every team member in these high-stakes matches. In the end, United won the shootout 4-2, with Rasmus Hojland scoring the winning penalty. Despite the victory, the match sparked criticism of United's performance, particularly their defensive vulnerabilities. Yet, the spirit of the game was undeniably intense, marked by missed penalties, VR controversies and the relentless determination of both teams. The result sets up an FA Cup final between Manchester United and their city rivals Manchester City, promising another thrilling match. But for now, the focus remains on this semi-final game, a match that delivered drama, excitement, and a testament to the unpredictable nature of football. The beautiful game indeed.